Diving Helmet Puzzle, one of my favourite puzzles from the Room 3. Stunning detail, absolutely stunning. And quite scary. I'm gonna draw here, let's see what's inside. We've got a bit of paper. The rocks of this island have always had a taste for blood. This tenacious aquanaut thought his science would be proof against them. I hope his curiosity into my affairs is now satisfied. The craftsman. An antler. So, what do you think happened to him? The diver. Yes, Talisman and Co. Everything's made by Talisman Company in this game. So we're going to try and get into the helmet somehow. Look how real all the textures look, all the wood and the metal. It's just such a beautiful game, this. It's worth spending the money on. Oh, what's this? Gives you clues a little bit too regularly. But then again, most of the puzzles I find you need a few clues here and there. Another one on that side. We need a screwdriver, don't we? What's that there? Can this be moved? It doesn't look like it. Diving apparatus. Guildford, Surrey, England. Not fit for purpose. Right. Well, we've got this antler. So looking around the room, we've got this enormous, wonderful model that we've been gradually making come to life here, bit by bit. We've also got... Oh, we had a desk somewhere, but the light's gone off on the desk, so I'm guessing the antler... Well, the antler can't be used... Oh, let's have a go with the antler. Let's look at it. That's, I think, got some moving bits on it, hasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I remember the moving bits, but... I'm not quite sure what we do with them. Perhaps we have to put the antler in position before we can move it. Hmm. Hmm. I don't remember any other antlers anywhere. Um. We go miniature and we go into these rooms. No, we just go into these rooms again and again. That was all for earlier stuff that we've been doing. I've got to light this lighthouse. Okay, so that I've got to light that as somehow. Um, I, I, oh, there might be some another puzzle to do here. Is there anything antlery here? Not really. Oh wait, What's, this is like a tree antler. A tree is like an antler. Yeah. Should we go and look at a clue? I always feel bad looking at clues. I feel like I haven't won. Let's go back to the diving helmet again. We can't look at the base or the pedestal. I'm pretty sure we need a screwdriver. Is there any other detail on the drawer that I've missed? Secret compartment. Can't see it. Let's close the drawer again. No, yeah, close the drawer. No secret thumbprints anywhere. Can't see them. Can you? Oh, what's this? Oh! Aha! A small brass rivet. And we've got some sort of code there. We've got an infinity. 
a, a Maltese cross type thing and, and mountains. Okay. The brass rivet's got to go on here somewhere, hasn't it? It's a brass rivet. Oh, look. Can that unscrew? No, not yet. A small brass rivet. Is there one missing there? I think there is. Yeah. Oh. Oh, because it's been used so much to do that. There are no fancy things to say. Ah, yes, now then. Here's our symbols again. So what did we say? We had infinity. We had cross and we had mountains. I can't see where we go with that. Oh, acorn, a small acorn. And there's a switch there. Aha, uh -huh. okay. Let's have a look at the acorn. I uh, thought so. Turns into a key. Oh, and we got another piece for the um, thing. Incidentally, oh, I can't go back to that now. Right, let's go back, find out where this piece goes. Oh, I think I recognise that shape. It's a blobby shape. Does it go the blobby here? Okay, there's an observatory. Got to do something with it, I reckon. It's not doing anything. Oh yeah, yeah. Round and round. Oh, round. Yep, yeah, line it up. Open it. In we pop. This is one of the many animals, the secret ways that you open them. Some of them are quite, quite funny. Like the snake, you have to pull its tail, the snake. This one, the grasshopper, what are you doing? Pulling its legs. And then that lever. And what happens now? Has that opened something? Oh, presumably that's opened something to give me a bit of... Can I pull its head now? Legs. Not doing anything. Back of legs. Another switch there. His head's poked forward. Pull it out. Ah, a metal pointer. Ah, yes, now we can do the code. Can't we? You'll see what I mean. We take this metal pointer. We go back to the diving helmets. We go back to this thing here. And we stick the pointer on here. Well, that alone already gives us something. Ah, oh, right. Okay, so we're going to go. What did we say? We go to. First, we go to that. That, then cross, then mountains. I should do something. <laughs> right, it's given us a copper tap. It's got triangular fitting on it. Okay, so it's, it's like a, it's almost like a spanner. It's got a triangular shape on it. I saw a triangular shape on this helmet somewhere. Where did I see it? Was it in here? No, that's where the thing came from. I thought I saw a triangular. Maybe it was somewhere else I saw the triangle. Well, there. Oh, okay. Line those up and see what happens. Does that do anything? What do we do with this?
What's this? I've still got something here. Metal acorn. I don't know what that does yet. Okay. We'll get a clue in a minute. We might have to look at the clue. Because I'm a bit foxed now. It won't let me click on anything. What's that? Uh, Surely that, that opens now by swinging, but I've got to undo that nut. I don't know how to, so we're going to have to probably wait for the next clue. Let's have a wait and look. Still something holding the main wheel. I, I know that. Okay, that hasn't... Okay, that clue doesn't count because that's... Oh, it will let me unscrew it. I just wasn't close enough to it. Okay. I deliberately didn't say anything because I knew that was coming. I remembered that bit. You don't forget that bit. And I wanted to make you jump out of the skin. A crystal file. Isn't that beautiful? Isn't that absolutely beautiful? Look at the colours, the rendering on that. That's fantastic. So this is a crystal file. So it's got some sort of liquid in it. Okay, so he didn't make it. So we're going to try and maybe see if we can light the thing with it, maybe, I don't know. Can we light the towel with it? Is that where it goes, you know? Let's try it. No. Oh, I've gone into bedtime mode. Which means it's gone midnight. Just had to put my colour back on there. Okay, so... Crystal file doesn't do anything there. Acorn doesn't do anything. Antler doesn't do anything. I'm going to go for another clue. There's a painting of a tree on the side of the box. Yeah, I looked at that and I thought there was something to do with the antler, but I couldn't make it do anything. Where is it? Let's go and have another look at it. Could it be a clue? Well, I kind of thought it could be something to do with antlers. As you know, trees, antlers, they all kind of look similar. This tree here, that's what it's talking about. Oh, acorn! Of course. Acorn tree. Oh, and here's the antler. Okay, let's chuck it on. <coughs> Now we can rotate the bits, try and make it symmetrical. Is that matching? No, not quite. It won't behave itself. <coughs> Sorry about my cough, not very well at the moment. Which is why I'm sitting at home playing games and I ought to be... These stones must have been used to crush, crush something for a, a kind of ritual. Crush this. What does it give me? What does it yield? A glowing gemstone. There we are. There it is. It has yielded. A glowing gemstone. Okay, so now we can light the light on the tower. And probably the light on the actual tower. See it through the window there. We'll probably go on as well. You can see it there by the moon, the actual tower. In goes the glow. Bang. Bob's your uncle. The light is on. Okay, is the chapter complete? Oh, no, I get to take it away. What do I do now? Does the whole model collapse? The whole model collapses, and an elevator comes down. Uh, 
I'm going to make the wild guess that I have to step into the elevator. There's a TIE fighter. That's Darth Vader's TIE fighter, actually. Oh, not anymore it isn't. Now it's, a, now it's a wheel. I'm in the lift. I'm in it. I'm going up. In a spiral. Wow. In a wonderful tilt there to Riven, we go up in a lift. We don't do that much Riven-y travelling in this, but that, that's got to be a tilt to Riven, that. Now, um... What's what the hell's all this? Let me see what I'm looking at. Got, what is this all? Oh, what is it? What do you do with it? Oh, okay. I've still got this illuminated lamp here. I bet I have to put that inside it. Then we, then we will be lighting the real tower that we're in. I think we're in the tower, aren't we, already? Oh. Ooh. No, I'm not going to have a clue yet. I want to work out what this is. I can't really see what it's doing. Oh, that's crosses and that's waves. That's... Right, we're going to line these up. Patterns, I reckon. Ah, oh, okay, so we just attach one. There we are, now they're lined up. Ah, oh, and that means that there's a hole there. Look, there's a complete hole there. Probably lines up with a hole in this. We can put the fire inside there, look. In it goes. We've lit the lamp. Dazzling. And we've got the pyramid from this level. Chapter complete. So that's the lighthouse. Scaling the lighthouse was quite the feat, though its beam may illuminate troubles to come. They remain yours to shoulder. Hope you've enjoyed that. Please go ahead and buy all of the room games. I guarantee you they're all fantastic. Start with the first one. They get better and better as they go along. I think three is probably my favourite, actually. Uh, but Old Sins is also amazing, and 2 is good. 1 is relatively short compared to the others, but I still recommend that you start with it, because then you'll experience the whole story, so you buy 1, 2, 3, and then Old Sins. They are all amazing. Um, every one of them ups the ante from the ones that came before, and they are well worth the money. I've played them over and over and over, sometimes with a few months in between, and the puzzles there's so much to them that you will not remember it all you get so much from playing them again the room games that was one of my favorite puzzles the diving helmet so there it is hope you enjoyed that